we need to promote more people of color. We just, we're not excelling there. We had done a really good job in certain areas, but we were lacking, particularly men of color. Um, and we had created this um, program where we were bringing folks together, really get them uh, more development, a little more exposure. And we just took that program and now I've really expanded it. And so we're looking at that program and the number of promotions. So we're actually looking at real numbers. We want to make sure that, you know, and look, we're not going to solve this overnight, but if you don't have numbers and kind of a measurement system to say, are we making progress? You're never going to get there. Uh, we use our great places to work survey because that survey is a culture survey. And there are a lot of open-ended questions that, that can really give you a sense. One of the things they've been working on is this question around feeling like you belong. And I don't know if they have the, the, the question down right yet, but I think we're all still trying to figure it out. But you know, there's one thing to say you have a diverse and inclusive group or a company. It's another thing that people walk in the door every day or online <laughs> and actually feel like they belong and could be their, their true self inside a company. And that's where I think you really make a difference, where people feel like I can come in and be who I want to be, when I want to be it, and not feel, you know, threatened in any way or feel like I'm fully accepted. That measure is a hard measure to get to, I must admit, but it's one we keep trying to chase a little bit because I think that's when you really know you have a very inclusive culture that accepts everyone.